Time for easy trivia. The first category is U.S. history. Lunchbox, who was the very first president of the United States? My boy, George Washington. That's correct. Good job. Eddie. Come on. Where is the White House located? In Washington, D.C. That's correct. Good job. Independence Day, Morgan, is another day, another name for what holiday? July 4th. Correct. And Amy, who's the current U.S. president? Uh, Joe Biden. Correct. Good. Easy yeah. trivia. That's the game. It's the easiest trivia game in the whole wide world. Well, you don't want to miss one because if you miss one, you'll hear this. You've been booed. Nobody wants to get boned, right, everybody? No. Not this, not this early anyway, no, all right? No, no. <laughs> Never. All right, you're playing for the championship. Lunchbox is the current <sighs> champion. He's got the, the TR over there. Lunchbox has two wins on the season. Eddie has two wins. Amy has one. Morgan, hello. hello. And so you're playing to five. <laughs> Ready, guys? Come Ready. on. Easy trivia. The category is bunny rabbits. Ooh. What's up, Doc? Is the catchphrase, Lunchbox, of what famous rabbit? Bugs Bunny. Correct. Eddie, what kind of profession put a rabbit and then pull it out of a hat as their act? Ooh, that would be a magician. Correct. Morgan, what battery company has a pink rabbit as a mascot? Oh, the Energizer Bunny. Correct. Amy, what's a group of wild rabbits called? There's no way. You got a really hard one. Well, this is what. Oh, we a, talked oh, about that on the talked show. About it. Fact, yeah. fact, That's but that right. Means we and have I to said I'm going to ask it on the uh-huh. show. Uh huh. Here it is. <gasps> That's right. But I mean, that's in. The, the first round is second. Second round. And I did say this was going to be a question. Oh, oh. I know it. You oh, but I, it? oh, I, I remember it. To get it? Oh, you do? Yes. I don't remember it, Amy. Wow. I, I, as soon as I read, it, I was like, "Well, that's hard." Then I was like, "I should know this." Like but once I, what, a week, I'm like, "Remember this," because he's going to ask. I it. did say I was going to ask it in this game. I will say that what I have in my head is not the right answer. But lunchbox, if, you're, if yours is right, Amy can have it. What is yours? Falafel. A falafel. <laughs> That's a well, sandwich. I, what I that's have like in my a, head is that's like a thing at the mall. <laughs> but please tell me he's close because what I have in my head is close to that. I'm not saying anything about his. I'm saying it's not a falafel. <laughs> a gyro. <laughs> right, because I think it's a fluffle. <laughs> is that your answer? Yes. Yes, it's a fluffle. Good. How did All you right. know that? Uh, falafel, though, pretty close. You can just say it with your accent. You, oh, I said it. Uh, uh, U.S. Head. geography trivia lunchbox. Yep. What's the largest state by land area? Largest physical state yeah. in the U.S. Alaska. Correct. Mm. That's pretty good. It's really good. <sighs> Eddie, what ocean borders California? That's the Pacific Ocean. Correct. Morgan, Rockefeller Center is in what city? New York City. Correct. Amy, what's the smallest state in the United States? Rhode Island. Correct. Moving on to the next category. Everybody's alive. Woo! Easy trivia. The category is shapes. <gasps> Lunchbox, mm. what shape has six sides? Hexagon. Correct. No, oh, don't pause like that. I was like, dang it, did I go too fast? Uh, Eddie, what uh, shape is a stop sign? That's an octagon. Correct. Morgan, how many sides does a cube have? A cube. Mm, okay. Ooh, ooh, hold on. One, two, it's a dice. One, two, three, four, five, six. Correct. Sorry. Nice. <laughs> Amy, how many sides does the Pentagon have? Well, the Pentagon, five. Correct. Nice job. We're moving Ooh. on to the next category. We're going a little faster. The category is country-related phrases. Mm. Fill in the blank. This is an apology for the use of profanity. Pardon my blank. Oh, French. Pardon my French. I get it now. I was like, I don't understand the category. Mm -hmm. Eddie, this means to follow the traditions or customs of a place being visited. When in blank. When in Rome. Correct. (sighs) Morgan, a phrase used to describe a person ducking out of a party, social gathering, or very bad date without bidding farewell. It is called the blank goodbye. The Irish goodbye. Correct. Amy, it's a way of saying you don't understand something that is said or written. It's all blank to me. Uh oh. What? It's all blank to me. Uh, well, what's the category a way of again? S- country related phrases. Country, well, foreign. That's what I would say. It's foreign to me. It's all foreign to me. It's all. Thinking of countries that would France and foreign to me. 
I'm sorry, that's incorrect. What is it? It's all Greek to me. Greek. What? Yeah. You've been that's boned. That's the hardest one. Amy, you've been boned. I don't. Uh, uh, the, Amy, the, you've been boned. <laughs> the next okay. category is horror movie characters. Lunchbox. Freddy Krueger is from what horror franchise? Nightmare on Elm Street. Correct. Eddie Jason is from what horror movie franchise? Friday the 13th. Correct. Morgan Michael Myers is from what? Halloween. Correct. Country band. Wait. Thank you. Oh, I was like, <laughs> I was like what? what? Country bands that start with the. That's what it says. What? The. Is that the category, Mike? The. Okay. okay. Hold on. Next category, country bands that start with the. Ready? Okay. Lunchbox, what country band sings the song? Grandpa, tell me about the good old days. The blank. Grandpa. The Judds. Correct. The Judds. Whoa, whoa, Correct. whoa. He just slammed the table. Eddie, what country band sings the song Cowboy Take Me Away? The Chicks. Correct. Morgan, what 80s country band sings Elvira? What? The, the Elvira. Elvira. I don't know the. Ah! Boner. Alabama. The, the Alabama. Alabama. Yeah. You've been boom. It's the Oak Ridge Boys. Oh, yeah. And now we're down to two. Easy. Oh, trivia. man. <sighs> this is focus. the easiest game in the whole wide world. Are you ready? Yeah. Ready. The category is famous U.S. quotes. Lunchbox. Who said four score and seven years ago? Abraham Lincoln. Correct. Yes. Eddie. Mm. Famous U.S. quotes. Who said, ask not what your country can do for you, ask what you could do for your country. Thank you for the accent. That's JFK. I tried to give you both a little something there. Nice. Appreciate that. A little, a little something, a little character in there. A little fur. A little <laughs> fur on the not. skin. Yes. The category is math. We're good at math. Yeah, I, I, I took math in school. Mm. <laughs> Lunchbox, what is 64 divided by 8? Eight. Correct. <sighs> ah, just bone me. Uh, not the first time, huh? <laughs> just tapping out. This is bone me. Eddie. What? What's the square root? Oh, you know I don't know square roots. Go ahead. Of 144. What? 144? Something that, that what you... goes into each other, like. Oh. Like, 144 would Eddie, be... Do you know what a square root is? No, not really. Like, uh, a number that goes in itself. That's the way it's been explained. Right? It's been explained weird. <laughs> That's fine. Like, like a number that you... I'm can... not going to tell you, but oh. that is a weird explanation. Hmm. What is a square root? So, I'm looking for the square root of 144. Like, if... Uh, like, what times what is 144? A square root? It's kind of fun watching him squirm. What is it, like 12? If you hit this, it's a, it's a Disney movie. If you hit this, you, come, oh, you came from yeah. nothing, from behind. Because really I don't know what it is. What's the square root of 144? 144. It's got to be something like 7. Give me 7. The you, square root of 7 is 144. You said 12. That would have been the right answer. That was your first It was instinct. 12? Yes! Let's go! 12 times 12 is 144. You've been boned. Ah! I told you, just bone. Ah! He, All I do he is wins win. again. Oh, do you want to hear your next three questions when they would have been lunchbox? Yeah! If it had kept going around. Oh, do your thing. And they stay there! And they stay there! That's on me. That's on me. He's, he's in the lead again this season. Oh, my gosh. Lunchbox, what animal villain wore a black dress and a long coat of Dalmatian spotted fur? Oh, Crua DeVille. I'll accept it. Cruella DeVille. Mm, not bad. The next category would have been movie quotes. We're going to need a bigger boat. It's what movie? We're going to need a bigger boat. Uh, Forrest Gump. Incorrect. That's Jaws. You let him there. I like yeah, you it. did the, I like it. You, you put some fur on that one. <laughs> <laughs> a little too furry for yeah, you? A little, a little too furry. Too furry. <laughs> there is our winner, though, with three wins. He's so close. Lunchbox is our big winner. It's a